It's Jennifer from Happiness is Homemade 4. And welcome to my channel. All right, y'all. It's Friday. So happy weekend to you. Um, it is 8.30 in the morning here as I'm filming. So I'm a little like raspy sounding this morning. Um, and I'm surrounded by totes. <laughs> so if you can see this over here, I'm like slowly decorating for Halloween. I mix fall and Halloween. So if you see this here in... I got a mess everywhere. Today, I still have everything in bags. I just brought it all in. I sat here on the counter. So we're just gonna like go through each bag, kind of see what we can pull out. And I love doing it that way. It's like a surprise for me and you. <laughs> all right. Oh, oh my gosh, y'all. They brought back the little pumpkin gumball machine. This is so cute. And this to me is fall and Halloween. This is adorable. You can add you a little bow, like a little gingham bow, a little black and white polka dotted bow or something to it. Around this, fill it up with some candy corn, peanuts, um, or just some kind of like a vase filler. But this right here is adorable. And Target is doing like a bigger, like glass version of this. So you can get this for $1.25 versus the one at Target, which takes up storage space and is $5. But love that. Oh, I grabbed a little package of the mini hay bills. Um, they don't look as good this year, but they're still adorable. You get eight pieces. Eight little hay bills. Oh, I got some of the cutest stickers. Look at these. I'm probably getting a glare. Alright, let's take this out of there so you don't get that glare. But look. And they're like... Um, they're raised. There's like a little foamy piece behind it. So, so whatever you put this on, they're gonna be like kind of coming out. Look how adorable. You can make the cutest little sign with these. 15 stickers on this sheet. Alright, oh! <laughs> they brought back the cookie cutters. Wow. Alright, look. On each one, you get three Halloween cookie cutters. You This one you get a casket, a piece of candy, and a pumpkin with a hat. See the pumpkin with the witch hat? Love these right here. You can decorate. You don't have to like make cookies with them. You can decorate with these. Especially if you do like a Halloween tree in your kitchen. You can make you a garland for your kitchen using these. This one has a ghost, a spider web, and a bat. Um, also, I used to make Riley little peanut butter sandwiches with cookie cutters. We would use a bat, and I told him it was Batman. <laughs> the kid, uh, when he was little, had a lot of like sensory issues. So the only way he would ever eat like a peanut butter sandwich was if he thought it was because of Batman. So, if you got a picky eater, stuff like this helps. This one has vampire fangs, a witch hat, and like a skull and crossbone. That one. And then this has a skull, a ghost, and the skull of crossbone. This one. Yeah, but make it like a really cute garland or something for your kitchen with these. Um, <laughs> I already see the birds. If you have the glass like canister, like I've got a glass canister back there, I could fill it up with these right here. Alright, well there's one bag down. Alright, next bag. Oh, look at this. This is called a, <laughs> it's a paper pack, exactly. Look at this. But the colorings that you can see in here are perfect for fall. This is the Crafter Square section. It does not say like how many pieces you get, but it's basically like scraps. But I am curious, let's see, what do you get? Oh, it feels like cardstock. Oh, that's nice. You know, this is thick. That is really thick. Look at that beautiful glitter. That is beautiful. So I got two of those in this one. Oh, look at that color. Kind of like what I'm wearing. That is so pretty. Oh, there's multiples of this one. Look at that. <laughs> and seriously, like, they just ripped it. Okay, this goes in here. This goes in there. Yeah. 
We got that. Oh, this beautiful like mustard yellow color. And like I said, there are like multiples of each one. I mean, there's some purples in here. This one has like a rust, rust color. You got this like dark, oh, this would be really pretty for like Halloween. It's like that dark purple, but look. See the flowers like embossed on it? Wow, look at that together. Ooh, how pretty is that? I mean, gosh, there's so many different pieces in here. That is great. Um, two, I know like junk journaling has got really popular. So if you do all that junk journaling stuff or scrapbooking, hey, <laughs> go to Dollar Tree. Oh, brand new, at least brand new to my stores. They had an ink pad in the Crafter Square section. They also had red, green, and blue, what I saw. I just grabbed a black one to try to see how it works. Because I found like a stamp set, like letters, and I had no clue what to do with them. So, I'm gonna try it with this. It does say pigment ink pad, acid-free, non-toxic, conforms to ASTM, blah, blah, blah. But yeah, ink pads at Dollar Tree. Oh, oh my gosh. All right, if y'all are on Instagram or TikTok or whatever, have you seen people who go into like thrift stores and buy like old like paintings and then they're taking them home and making them spooky. Like they'll add like ghosts to them and pumpkins and bats. I got this canvas at Dollar Tree so I could try it. <laughs> but let me open this because you're getting a glare. All right, yes. All right, look at this painting. This is Dollar Tree. Dollar, everything in here is $1.25. But I could try to add like some little ghosts to this. I could add some bats or a moon up here. Uh, put some pumpkins like on the little um, walkway. How cute would that be? So yeah, I do want to try this. And I thought to go with this. Is it in here? Yes. The rub on transfers. I'm wondering if I could just put this onto this canvas, like how that would look. Because <laughs> I am not the best painter. But this one right here, I love this one. This one's my favorite. Uh, let me open this up for you. I never know like filming if you're getting a glare, so. Yeah, so these are rub-on transfers. But look at that. I mean, could you imagine like adding to a little ghost, that ghost and that pumpkin right there onto this painting? I think that's gonna be really cute. <laughs> I mean, all these pumpkins I could like have going down the pathway. So that one, um, this one right here is very like vintage looking to me, like very like Johanna Parker too. That, yeah, this one, look. Look at the black cat. Ooh. Spiders, if you want to add a spider. You got more pumpkins. You got Hooray for Halloween. This one is really cute to craft with. And then this one. Look, this one you just got like, like skulls and crows and spiders and a haunted house. More like spooky ghost on this one. Yeah, not only can you craft with these, but I'm really thinking of trying to add them onto this painting. Um, oh, this was at the counter, like the checkout lanes. It is a USB mini vacuum cleaner. Look at this. Have you tried this? And so have you tried this or known someone to try it? Because I am curious like how well it works. It says it's USB. The um, cord is five feet long. No batteries needed. Great for dust and crumbs. Keeps your desk clean. Works with most USB ports. Uh, you know what? Let's just open this up. <laughs> Let's see. <gasps> oh my gosh. Remember the little dust busters? What was that like? Late 80s, early 90s, the dust buster? It looks just like a dust buster. All right, how do you open this? I push that button. It's got a little filter. Put that back around there. 
Wow. Oh, do I have a... You know what? <laughs> I wouldn't do it right now. But at the end of the video, I have a plug over here. Um, we'll try it. I'll put some little crumbs down and see if it works. All right. Next bag. Oh, they have... I found emergency apple cider vinegar. But it's like you mix it into a drink. Like, you know, the gummies we've been finding? This is a drink. You get 18 little packets. Uh, let's open this up. Did I tell you what? Germs are going around. Oh, look. It's just like those little, like, crystal light packets. Yeah. It says, so you take your packet, you take four to six ounces of water, which is not a lot. <laughs> Eight ounces is a cup. So, add as much as you like to it. Yeah. So, you get 18 packets in here. Uh, it just says natural apple cider vinegar, high potency vitamin C, antioxidants, B vitamins, and electrolytes. I thought this was a great deal. That, that, oh, I found Vaseline all-purpose cream. I am always trying to find something for my dry skin. Uh, with Vaseline Jelly, Glycerin, and Vitamin E for soft and healthy skin. All right here. Uh, just has like, just like a natural kind of lotion kind of smell to it. Yeah, with my thyroid, my skin is always dry. So, a little something extra. So, a little something extra. Oh, I found more. Centrum. This is the minis. Men vitamins, but this says men immune support, so this may be a little bit different. But there's 160 tablets in here, so that is great. And I really don't know what the difference between men's and women's, I'm sure anybody can probably take this, but it is it does say men, men's immune support. Um, oh, Riley grabbed this. Betty Crocker No Bake Bites Cookie Dough. Look at that. And this, and this is a 12.2 ounce. I mean, this is like a normal size box. But yeah, it says no bake. So I am curious, like, what this would taste like. So we got that one. All right, there's that bag. All right, next. Oh, <laughs> I grabbed Riley more socks. I just got one pair, though. Look, it's Twinkies. Look how cute these are. Y'all, if you got any birthdays coming up, um, a boo basket, if you're gonna like boo somebody, um, stocking stuffers, this is kind of stuff because it's name brand and it's fun. This makes like great stocking stuffers. <laughs> if you can remember where you put things. Like I have bought so many things in the past and I'll hide it <laughs> and then I forget all about it. Look at that. Look how cute. And men and women can wear these. But I did get these for Riley. Oh, I found another pretty cool thing. This is a USB um, laptop light. Look at that. Once again, it's $1.25. Uh, USB powered, flexible design, 14 bright LEDs, and has the 60 lumens. So, Riley sometimes at night will like sit in bed and like work on his laptop. A little extra light for him. Oh, wow. <gasps> wow! How great is that? So like this will plug into the side of his laptop and then he can have this kind of like, shining down. That is really great. Wow. If you're someone who like travels for work, and you're working on your laptop and you need just a little extra light somewhere. Like, all right, so let's see. Oh, <laughs> ketchup. Always get our ketchup at Dollar Tree, but it's Hunt's. That is a huge name brand. Uh, and this is 20 ounces. So I got our ketchup. Um, ooh, I grabbed some green palm olive. It's apple pear. But this is for my Halloween decor. I need this for something that goes by our sink. So I'm gonna fill it up with this green. And of course I had to get like an um, apple. <laughs> um, they had normal green, but I got the apple pear. Oh. 
I meant to give this to my husband. I just grabbed him a, a Blistex little chapstick. All right, next bag. Oh, I grabbed these two garlands because I thought the coloring was really pretty. Look at that. I'll always get like two or three because they're very like sparse. I don't know if you've ever bought like the garlands from Dollar Tree. Let's see. They are five feet long. Let's see. It's like the big gaps in between them. But the best thing, you get you a couple of them and just combine them, like twist them together and mix it really full. But you can also like loop them around and make like a full little wreath or candle ring out of these. Like this right here, you get like in a circle just right and put your candle down inside of it. And it's really pretty. Oh, my favorite. <laughs> <laughs> I love fuzzy socks. That is mine and Presley's like favorite thing from Dollar Tree is their cute fuzzy socks. So I grabbed us some purple bats. We both love purple. So I got two pairs of these because I know we're both going to be wearing them. Good job. Ooh, look how cute they are. I love those little bats. Um, and these are like kind of like the taller ones. All right, look. Oh, look at that. Oh, y'all, they're like butter. <laughs> these are so soft. So I got those. I also got some more candy corn socks. I have the ones I put out like two years ago. I still wear them. These are cute because I got the candy corn. And then almost like a little orange and white peppermint. So I got those. And then I also grabbed these because I thought they were so cute. Look at that. Look how like retro old school this is. <gasps> Look. <laughs> They're so tall. If you have like tall boots that you wear, like tall socks like this is great to wear with some boots. These are adorable. Oh my gosh. You'll be so festive in these right here. That is so cute. And I love that the whole thing is covered in jack-o'-lanterns. That's so cute. Look, that trick-or-treat. Oh, they brought back the little mini pumpkins. Look, it's a little like trick-or-treat pills. I love it. These are so cute. You get four of them. They also had it in green. Look at that. How cute is this? So cute to decorate with. Put these on a tiered tray. Um, I have a craft ideal using this right here. So, love these. All right, well, there's that bag. Oh, name brand. This is a big fun. Look at this big old pouch of Lysol antibacterial wipes. You get 80 wet wipes in here. This is great. Keep this in your kitchen, bathrooms. <laughs> We're always cleaning. But how great is that? You have you spill something, you know, just a quick little bite down. Got those. Oh, I got a big thing of the foaming hand wash refill. For some reason, my husband thinks foaming get your hands cleaner. <laughs> oh, whatever. So yeah, this is his favorite. So I got this, and I think it is kind of leaking. All right, this is a big one right here. Look at this, it's a yard steak. Um, you got the bat, but what I loved about it, it says, witch's brew served daily. How cute would this be? Pop these two signs off right here and put them over by like your coffee pot. You know, you could make like a cute little sign you could just prop these up on a tear tray. But these two right here, I just thought was perfect for kitchen decor. <laughs> you can even do a little bat too. Like you don't have to leave it on the steak. It's just stapled on. Just carefully, just pop them right off. But, oh, I grabbed the multi-colored ornaments. Look, you can't always find like the multi-packs of them. Normally it's like black or orange or purple. This has all the colors. Look at that. You're getting blacks, 
oranges and purples in one pack for $1.25. And you get 16. Those. Oh, okay, y'all. I have the bird feeder on our window. I get so many like people love to watch the birds kind of as a film. All right, at Dollar Tree in like the bathroom section, they have this toothbrush cup holder. Look, it sections. I remember, maybe it was like last year, K is for Karen was talking about like a bird feeder that you could do at Dollar Tree. And I think when I saw this, I think this is what she was talking about. Because the bottom, and pay attention to what you're getting, don't get the one that's open in the front. Like this is solid all the way around. But the bottom has a couple little holes in it. Like mine is just suction cup to my window. This has suction cups. Get one of these, put you in some sunflower seeds, some peanuts. I get a big bag of like bird food at Walmart for like $5. But you could try one of these. You know, if you just want to kind of see. All right, yeah. <laughs> so those two right here, they're gonna suction cup to your window and just fill it up with some, I think I have some, yes. I buy, y'all, the squirrels, y'all, my Blue Jays, the Blue Jays and the squirrels love these big old shelled peanuts. And it amazes me that a bird will pick up one of these and just fly away with it in its mouth. I wish I could like catch one doing it. But this, get you some sunflower seeds. You can get everything you need at Dollar Tree. Pour it in here, stick it outside. It may take a little bit, but it will attract some birds. Which, there's a bird in the window right now. I don't know if you can even see that. It's in the, the bird feeder. Whoop, <laughs> what oh, just flew away. Oh, oh my gosh. I Finally, finally found the cute little light ups. Look at these, like the little like marquee little signs. So there is a ghost. It's got a pull tab, so make sure you look for that. All right, let's pull this. We're gonna light it up. Can you see that? How cute. Turn that off and then back on. That's adorable. It's a little ghost. And then there's a jack-o'-lantern. All right. <laughs> if I don't break him first. <laughs> All right, let me pull this. All right, let's see. <gasps> that is cute. Turn that off. Back on. Okay, he is my favorite. That is adorable. How cute would this be like in a kid's room too? Like a bathroom is a nightlight or like in a kid's room lit up? Oh, all right. All right, I have some pretty cool new finds. Y'all, have you seen these new skull trays? It's like a platter, is that they're calling it? Tray, platter. Look at this, look at this beautiful, like is that like an iridescent? Like I remember, <laughs> like this was like chameleon. Like cars in the 90s would be like this chameleon paint job. Wow, and if you're in Louisville, like we used to like cruise Preston and stuff on the weekends. <laughs> so look at this. So they had this color and they also had this black one. I think this one right here is so like high-end, like chic looking. It's like something you're gonna find like Pottery Barn, a lot more money at Target or something. How great is it? Um, it is like that like plastic melamine kind of feel, but I love it. They also had a silver one. I just grabbed one of these. If you're gonna do like a movie night, have all your snacks and stuff on here. But I think this is great too. I think this would be great just propped up to decorate with. Like in the corner or something of your counter. I love it. Y'all, Dollar Tree has had some of the best new um, decor this year. Like they have really, for that, for that quarter, 
they've really like stepped up. Love it. I can't wait for Christmas to kind of see like what we get for Christmas because this stuff is so good. Let's see. Oh, this also is a brand new fan. Look at this. Look how cute this little tassel is. It says home sweet home. I love that. That is so pretty. And if you wanted, you could just completely paint over this and make it say like boo, like put B-O-O -O on here and just change it up. But I think that is so pretty. You got the little wooden beads to it, the little tassel, pretty as is, or like I said, change it to put eek. You could do eek, add a spider to it, or do um the boo-o-o, -O -O. boo. <laughs> Do boo o o, b o o, and just some ghosts to it. You know what? That's a really cute craft idea. So yeah, something like that. Speaking of like craft, I just grabbed some more of the thin ribbon. Love these. The little black and white spider web. That is great. This has the orange and black skulls on it. it says Happy Halloween. And then purple glitter. <laughs> the, the birds will lay in there and then they see me in here moving and they all take off. Yeah, this right here, this little um, thin ribbon is so cute to add to any little craft that you're making. But, all right, that's it. I kind of feel like my store it's like at first they were bringing in so much new stuff right away. And at my stores, it's kind of just the same thing right now. Like I'm not really seeing anything new come through. But as soon as I do, we'll do another haul. <laughs> but I am about to take like a little road trip. So maybe I'll hit like a couple different Dollar Trees on the way there and back. And kind of see if we can like find anything new. Because I feel like, you know, when you kind of like travel away from your, your stores, you can find some new things. If I find anything good, we'll do another haul like on maybe on Sunday or something. Oh, also, we just made a giant spider wreath. So, if you missed that video, I will link it down below for you. It is so cute. Oh, there it is. <laughs> it's, it's still on like our utility door. But look how cute that is. Yo, that is a Dollar Tree spider wreath. The only thing that's not Dollar Tree on mine is my deco mesh, but you can get mesh it at Dollar Tree. All right, I got the little, the little uh, dust buster right here. This cord, it is five feet long, so it is really long. I'm wondering if I could use this in my car because Riley is so daggone messy. So I may try this in my car too, but I'm gonna sprinkle a little crumbs right here. I'm gonna see if I can like dust, if I'm, um, this will like vacuum it up. Charger block, plug that in. All right, you see the crumbs right there? I'm gonna turn it on. <gasps> it's working. Do you see that? Let me zoom in. All right, you are zoomed in. See those crumbs right there? It worked! Open that up. You push this little button. Oops. Push that little button right there to release it. To open it up. <gasps> Do that over a garbage can because they all just spilled out. But yeah, you know, look. See, there's still some in there. Just when you empty it, do it over a garbage can. Alright, y'all. This seriously works great. Get you one of these just to keep in your car, especially if you got messy kids or maybe like you take your pet with you or something. Wow. But, all right, that is it. I hope that you have a wonderful weekend. Relax and take care of yourselves and I'll see y'all next time. Bye guys. Thanks for watching.